fish on. This feels like a good one. Bet it's a trout. Of course it is. Well guys, there you go, lovely little brown trout. They're just on a bread flake. Um, I was hoping for a roach, but I'm gonna take him because he's great fun on the light gear. Afternoon guys, Andy the Budget Angler here, just out on the um, chalk stream. It's um, blowing an absolute hooli. Still no sign of summer coming back. We're now exactly six days into the uh, fishing season and I've only managed to get out on the first day of it. It's been so, so busy and I, I haven't got much time tonight. So I've come down to the chalk streams. So I haven't even had a chance to get out and explore any of my new stretches I can fish. So it's um, a favoured spot, but at least hope I know there are fish here. So hopefully I can get a few out. Um, actually, that's not technically true thinking about it. I have had another session on the river, but with lures. So you would have hopefully have seen that video by now. Um, yeah, so anyway, just got the usual, sent a pin, got me float. Um, Got me homemade float, so I've just, just noticed there's that geezer behind me. Um, he's thinking, why is he filming? Um, yeah, I've lost my th thread now. Oh yeah, that's it. I've got some maggots, got some bread, and um, hopefully we can get a few out for you. So fingers crossed, the next time you see me, I'll have a fish. There you go guys, lovely little roach there, that was just on a maggot and I missed so many bites on little bread and maggot and uh, yeah, just couldn't get them so I might scale the hook down, we'll see how we get on with this one, lovely little fish. Oh, it's going well again. Another trout I'd wager. Yes. There you go, guys. Another, another lovely little trout there. Really, really big pupil on his eye there. Cracking little fish. Slightly smaller than the last one. We're in guys, feels a bit more like a better roach, although you never can tell in this water. Mm. A marginally better roach, he's just crapped on me. What about that then guys, perfection in miniature, what a beautiful little trout, absolutely lovely. Oh, it's a bit more like it. Oh, it's a roach. What a cracking fear. I think it, it might be a dace. Oh. <laughs> what have we got here? Oh, it's a clonking rope. What about that for a little chalk stream roach? What an absolute beauty. Really, really good nick as well. Just a little spit in his tail there. That was just on a bread flake. Fantastic fish. Really pale as well, pale orange eye. I don't know if they change colour throughout the season, but that's the palest one I've ever had out of here of this size. What a lovely fish though, P cracking. Oh. 
Well, that's a very welcome little trout there, just in the uh, in the backlit sunlight. It's just there in front of me. I haven't had a fish for ages, so it's nice to get something. Oh, it's going well. Get out of them stream of weeds. Trout. Sun's come out, guys. Look at that. What a beautiful trout. Absolutely murdered the bread. They're worse than me at Harvester Buffet. They're straight on it. Absolutely cracking. Oh, this is a better fish. He's gone straight in the streamers. Oh no, he's out. Come on, stay out. I know it's going to be a trout. Up you come. Oh yeah, lovely. Finally got the right line. I could not get a trot on the line I wanted. I finally got it and boom. Oh yes, this is going mad. What about that then, guys? Absolutely. <laughs> Just quickly talk you through the gear I'm using, guys. It's the, it's the usual. Um, it's the damn quick shadow center pin. It's the um, 11 foot John Wilson Mirage, and it's a homemade float. This one is a kebab skewer with a balsa body and some decorative whipping and my little logo there on a transfer. And that's just a uh, fish with a double rubber and two BB. Um, one of the BB seems to have slid up the line there. That should have been about halfway down, but uh, there you go. And it's working, working well. Um, I'm not fishing near the bottom, it's on the deeper holes, but there's so much streamer weed that this kind of either slithers between it or just skirts over the top of it. And it is bringing the fish. So I'm um, happy enough with the, with the setup. Oh, and it's just a, um, it's a size 14 barbless hook with maggots or bread on it. Well guys, what about that then? What a cracking trout. I'm just, the, just as the GoPro gut dies, um, I got it. It was on the other side of the bridge over there and I thought I was going to rub the flipping line on the, on the masonry, but no, I actually managed to, um, to, uh, to, to get him in. He was absolutely mad. I can't believe I didn't get the fight on the GoPro. I'm absolutely gutted. It's the biggest trout I've ever caught and, um, it just went absolutely mental. So there you go. Such is life. Just try and show you him. Well, there you go, guys. Absolute belter. Cracking fish. Absolutely chuffed to bits with that. Brilliant. A bit more like it than the old pesky trout. Beautiful little roach there, lovely fish. What have we got here then? Little trout there, guys. Might be the last fish of the day, but it's great fun. Well, that wasn't a bad little session at all, guys. Really pleased I got out after work. Really, really nice there. That um, that 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 last big trout was great fun. The shame I didn't get the GoPro footage, but um, yeah, really, really good fun and, and a really nice just to get back out on the chalk stream, do a bit of bait fishing. 
Um, looking forward to some more of that. Just um, just filming this outro a couple of days later. I'm out, obviously, filming for another new adventure. Um, but hopefully you enjoyed that as much as I enjoyed making it. Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed it, please hit that thumbs up. Please drop me a sub, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers, guys. Fish on.